Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know, uh, a lot of important people are probably going to get sued. Yes. But there's what's known as procreation, the production of children. Yeah. Reproduction. <laughs> Now, uh, somebody took it upon themselves to be the reproduction of uh, beings. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, when, when you play God, yes, mm -hmm. you have this idea that, well, I'm going to make a lookalike spouse. And a lot of women were upset with that. <laughs> it's not that you just took the whole, well, I'm Paul and I'm going to be the conception. Yes. And you, the woman, you're going to be the gestation. Oh. <laughs> you decided to be God. <clears throat> Since you made them, you can destroy them. <sighs> you know, any time any person anywhere in the world decides that they're going to be the procreation, yes, uh, there could be a lot of people that get upset at your decision making. Now, you thought you were important. Mm-hmm. <laughs> And you thought that you could manufacture spouses and children and any other any other person that you wanted to make. Yes, because it was so important to you mm -hmm, to be able to prove that you could be God. Mm -hmm. Now, looking at India, yeah, there's approximately 1.5 billion people there. Mm -hmm. And you're going to make lookalikes of all of them, aren't you? Isn't that what you're going to do? Yeah. See, I inform you of what's important to me. Yeah. Procreation. Yeah. I'm the conception. Oh, and they're the gestation. Yes. But some technologists and some billionaires, they decided, no, mm -hmm. we do have to be able to make a lookalike of any, any person. Yeah. Now, from the wealthiest uh, individuals in India billionaires mm -hmm. to the the lowest class of person mm -hmm. the individual on the street yes that has absolutely no money mm -hmm. you've decided as little billionaire gods yes that you're going to replace all of humanity well how do you decide who's important enough to replace oh. i mean is it because of the amount of money they have mm -hmm. Is it that they're a government employee? Mm. Is it that they have some sort of influence that you want to be able to replace them as individuals? How do you make the decision? Mm -hmm. Which of us are important? Mm. Now, since you decided to play God, I'm going to really talk to you what's, uh, what's important. Mm -hmm. See, yesterday I was looking at what is known as the military commission yeah mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and um i did uh i did offline some documentation about uh, military tribunals yes and you said well we're american citizens and we just cannot be labeled as enemy combatants mm -hmm. in fact it could be that you're so important that you had your own security system <laughs> Now, I remember talking on the phone to a pastor when I wanted to borrow $50 to get a motel room. Yeah. <laughs> he said, I have three levels of security clearance. And I was like, oh, <laughs> well, exactly who was it that gave you the security clearance? Mm -hmm. Why don't you get me the most important people in India? Pooch. Now, usually to be able to have any security clearance, yes, you're either an employee of the government you're a corporate officer. Yes, you are. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. See, we have legislation that would make it a crime for you to be offering any security clearance. Yeah, it would be enemy combatant to have three levels of security clearance. Yes, when you're a local pastor. Boom! Now, I'd just like to know, yes, of these little gods that call them. Oh!